Hi, now we'll learn how to debug a background job. For example, if you are like executing one report in a background processing mode, okay, and or if you have some report which you are scheduled to run in the background mode on some different intervals, daily basis, weekly basis, etc. And you want to debug that. So as you know, we can check the background job in SM37, but how to debug that? So what we'll do? First here, I will trigger background job for this program. So here, like go to program, execute in background. Then instead of immediate, I want to set date and time. Just after one minute, I will set. Okay, and time here, I want to set as, let's say, 38 after two, three minutes. Check and save. Now, once the background job is scheduled, so you can check this in the SM37. Select schedule also. You can see what is the release because it will get triggered at the time which I set. Now, to open this in the debugging mode, First, what we can do, either before going into debugging mode, set a breakpoint here, okay, at this position, or we also have the option through from that program. So what we'll do, now this job, I want to debug. Select this, in the command, type JDBG, without any slash. Just type JDBG, and press enter. Okay, once you press enter, system will open the same job in the debugging mode. Now, if we have already set a breakpoint at this program, okay, so, okay, let me do that. I will set my breakpoint here. Now, we are into debugger mode. Okay, so if I press F8, see, the program is stopped at the line where I set a debugger. Okay. This is using setting a breakpoint before executing that. A second option, now I have deleted this. Okay, take example, I don't have the active breakpoint as of now and I want to debug the same again. So what I will do, I will select this, again JDBG, enter and here keep on clicking F7, return one, two, till here we see the, our actual program name, F7, F7, F7. See, now we can see our program name in the first event, initial, initialization, which is getting triggered. Okay, so from here, our breakpoint is getting executed. Now this will execute all the event one by one. Okay, now if you want to again set a breakpoint at different position, you can set in the same debugger area. Okay, now if I effect, so you can see the current record here, the execution line here. Okay, so like this way, we can debug a background job with a simple command JDBG by selecting the required job, type that command in the command field without any slash, any slash or any other suffix. Okay, so in this way, we done with this session on debugging a background job. Thank you.